ball, but um, yeah, I think as far as energy and stuff, they and how they feed off each other, I'd say this is probably a pretty good analogy. Thank you so much. Yep. What uh, what have you seen from uh, the NIU defense on film? Obviously, they, it seems like they have some disruptors up front. Yeah, they got it. Well, I think they're returning all four guys from yeah. last year. At least they played a lot. So they're just the good group up there, and they trust each other. They're not going to go out of the way to or try to make another play for a different guy. But uh, as far as defense, I think they just fly around and play good sound football. And up front, they they let the D line get after it a little bit and um, rush past it. Do they move Smith around? Uh, or is he? Do you know where he's going to be, or is he? Is he move around quite a bit? Most of the time, he's in the boundary. They do in one a certain situation, like third and long, he'll go to the field mm -hmm. a little bit. But other than that, he'll be in the boundary. So. Is, that, is it a weird alignment for them? It's like a three-four, but also can look like a four-three at times. Is that? Oh, uh, it's different. Just how they use him. I think they use him kind of like a linebacker a little bit. They yeah. stand him up, obviously, and um, they let him have free reign. You know, he can go inside and outside, and they'll make him right. So I think they just use Elitism to where he, he's always a night or matchup nightmare outside. You know, he's always somebody you got to think about, and that's what they want you to be doing. So that's I think that's how they use him. What have you seen from NIU on film? They've got a, a dual threat quarterback and mm -hmm. some some decent receivers. Yeah, I feel like they have a good offense. They have decent receivers, good quarterback. They have good running backs too. They average um, about like twenty something points a game. So I know that they can put points on the board. So we got to prepare for them like um, any other team that, even though they're in the MAC, the MAC is a really good conference. So we have to respect them. What's the challenge for you at your position when you have a guy back there? quarterback that can that can move and make plays with his legs as well as with his arm. Right. Um, yeah, the big thing is like um, when the quarterback uh, is on scrambling, you always have to stay with your receiver, you know, when they can get extra yards with, the, with their hands or with their feet. So just staying in tune the whole play, that's a big thing with dual threat quarterback.